The Massachusetts House is preparing to debate legislation tomorrow that would legalize sports betting in the state. And now local representatives are stepping up to make sure local businesses don't miss out on this new potential industry. Western Mass News reporter Lindsay Kane live for us in Springfield with the details. Lindsay. President Jordan, the current bill would restrict sports betting to casinos, racing tracks, and mobile apps. But State Representative Orlando Ramos wants to make sure that black and brown business owners also profit. Diversity, equity, and inclusion. And so, you know, I, I have filed an amendment to make sure that that language is included in the final version of the bill. House lawmakers on Thursday are set to debate a bill that would legalize sports betting in Massachusetts. The current bill would restrict betting to casinos, racetracks, and mobile apps. Neighboring states Rhode Island, Connecticut, New Hampshire, and New York have all authorized sports betting in some fashion. State Representative Orlando Ramos tells Western Mass News in Thursday's hearing he's proposing an adjustment to make sure additional groups of people can also profit. We want to make sure that we get, we're giving an opportunity for black and brown owned businesses to, to be able to benefit from this new industry. Not only is Ramos fighting for a seat at the table for local restaurants who have been hit hard by the COVID-19 pandemic, making sure betting would be allowed inside businesses. He also wants black and brown representation in what would be a new large industry across the state. There's very little diversity when it comes to ownership of these businesses. Uh, there are no black or brown owned casinos in the Commonwealth. Um, and there are very few uh, black and brown owned um, uh, marijuana businesses in the Commonwealth. Again, that hearing is planned for tomorrow. Be sure to stick with Western Mass News on air and online for the latest information. Live in Springfield, Lindsey Kane, Western Mass News. Lindsey, thanks for that live report. Senator Lindsey Sabadosa also adding an amendment to this bill that would ban the use of credit cards. She tells Western Mass News in a statement, quote, Using credit cards for gambling sets up a dangerous precedent that can lead to rapid excess spending. Additionally, many cards charge cash advance rates for gambling-related charges. Consumers need to be aware of these pitfalls.